Gun sales spiking following Friday's shooting at a Colorado movie theater. And with that, more people are now trying to obtain a concealed handgun license. Fox 7's Daniel Armbruster joins us live from Southwest Austin at a firearms dealership. And Daniel, what have you found out? Well, Mike, this seems to be a trend that's not only spanning Colorado and other parts of the country, but right here at home as well. In fact, one CHL instructor tells us he's seen a huge spike in those wanting a concealed handgun license since the shooting. The Colorado shootings have Americans and Austinites up in arms. I think if more people own guns, someone else in the movie theater could have had a gun and shot the guy before he killed the rest of the people. So I think more people should have guns. I think it just scared people. I already have a gun and I'm keeping it. I was thinking about selling it, but now I'm keeping it. And many who don't have guns are considering buying one. Robert Green is a concealed handgun license instructor and says He's seen a 20% increase in customers wanting to sign up since last week. First thing that people usually th think about is like, oh my gosh, that's horrific. Second thing is usually, what would I do if I was there? It's that what if that has many heading to firearms stores in Colorado and around the country. This is a 9mm. According to firearm salesman, one of the most popular handguns purchased by those who just got their concealed handgun license. Charles Harris owns storied firearms. He says increased sales is a sad fact that typically follows mass shootings. I hate events like this having an effect on sales be because it, it almost seems like blood money. Harris says regardless, most people feel more protection with a gun. I think people just recognizing that the more people there are, the more crazy people there are. But not everyone agrees that guns are the answer. They should be cracking down. You would think there would be like less gun sales, that would be more strict, but it's so easy to get a gun that it's ridiculous. Now anyone who intends to buy a firearm from a licensed firearm dealer like here at Storied Firearms, you're going to have to pass a background check conducted by the FBI first. And when it comes to concealed handgun licensing, that CHL instructor Mike tells us that out of the past six years that he's been teaching that course and the hundreds of people that have gone through, only two have not passed and been able to get their license.